So today we will meet the Sochang family and this family they live in the mid of uh, the, the lake. We're only at the start of the wet season and it's already flooded out their house. They're living in a swamp basically. This is their house at the moment. This is where they live guys. Unbelievable. It's more, eh? So she is Srinit and he is Reksa. Reksa. And she named Srilin and he named so his name Soja. <laughs> this man he does fishing every night. So they bring all two kids with his wife to the middle of the lake. So at 4 p.m. they just pick up everything that just for the night time and then put the kid on the boat and then they go to fishing and at night time the kid just sleep and then he just fishing. Someday if the storm come and rain come they try to protect the kid from the rain and storm and sometimes cannot have the big tree that can go down the under and then all the kids and why just get wet and so cold. Every night they all just sleep in the boat. And while I was down at your home, your old home, and I was looking over here, I could see these houses, and they weren't just houses, I was looking at hope. So every day you wake up and you look at these homes, I want you to think there's hope for a future. Let the storm come, you've got shelter. You have a future. Give your children a future. Empower them to go further than you came. So today we pray for your house, but really we are praying for your hope and for your future. Oh my.